What's up, comic creators? I'm gonna show you quickly how to add a transition I have identified uh, in my timeline here. Uh, two clips that I'd like to have a nice transition uh, in between so it's not just chopping uh, from one clip to the other. So in the top left-hand corner of your uh, project file, you'll see a, a small icon uh, at the very top of the screen uh, and underneath it, it'll say transitions and you go ahead and click that and that will open up um, a cap cuts a list of transitions that you can add into your project and it is quite extensive it's very impressive uh, compared to uh, other uh, free editing software such as iMovie and things like that so once you have identified uh, the transition that you'd like to use uh, you go ahead and click and grab uh, the tr that transition and drag it to the um, or to the spot that's in between the two clips in your timeline that you're wanting that transition to take place. It will create a small uh, gray bar icon uh, in your project uh, that represents the transition that you can uh, always identify it with. Um, so you know that it's there and uh, you can always click that gray bar to customize it or if you want to delete it you can click that gray bar and uh, and then click the trash icon uh, to delete it um, or uh, you can have this uh, options for uh, further customization in the top right hand side of your screen um, and once you click it and have it highlighted it'll open up uh, a list of customizations that you can make and changes that you can make to the transition so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the duration slider here to increase the time so as I drag it you can see on the right hand side the seconds uh, meter is increasing as I drag it and I feel like when you increase the duration of the transition it actually causes the transition to be a lot smoother going from one clip to the other and so I'm using that tool to uh, cause the transition to be uh, very smooth and not so jagged um, when it transitions from one shot of the forest to the next shot of the forest and that is pretty much uh, everything you need to know about adding transitions between your clips and cap cut uh, now that you know this you can get in there and play around with it and really uh, master uh, the perfect transition for your for your project and so guys I hope this helps uh, let me know if you have any questions in the comments below thank you for watching if you found this video helpful please take the time to like comment and subscribe as it helps us to further please our YouTube overlords check out more links in the description for continued assistance on your CapCut projects and please keep your arms and legs inside the craft until it comes to a complete stop be sure to mind your headspace and watch your step as you exit. Failure to comply may result in serious injury or death. We will see you next time, Comet Creators. End transmission.